The rockets need a lot of fuel to go so high and fast. Their motors run on a special fuel that can't be bought at gas stations. Help our little friend to clean the glass of his space. Do you know how big each planet is? Show it. the asteroid into small pieces to prevent it from crashing into the Earth. <laughs> Order the planets from the closest to the farthest from the Sun.
saw the Earth's orbit around the sun. The sun is a star like those seen in the sky. It is at the center of the solar system, and there's life on Earth thanks to heat and light from the sun. It's like a giant fireball. <laughs> Venus is about the size of Earth and is composed of the same rocky materials, but we could not live there because it's much hotter and is covered in volcanoes and poisonous gases. Earth is the only planet in the solar system where there is life. Like all planets of the solar system, it revolves around the sun, following a path we call an orbit. It takes a year to go around the sun and one day to revolve once on itself. Mars is a very dry planet, like a desert, and it's covered in red sand. That's why it's called the red planet. Have people ever gone to Mars? No but we've sent spaceships and robots to explore the planet. Maybe an astronaut will arrive there someday. Saturn is well known thanks to its fabulous bright rings. These rings are formed by millions of ice particles. It's pretty, isn't it? Neptune is covered by a thick, gaseous layer and is very cold because it's very far from the sun. It looks like a blue-green disk with a telescope. Mercury is the planet closest to the sun and the smallest of the eight in the solar system. During the day, it is very hot, but at night, it's very cold. On the surface, there are many craters caused by meteorites that have crashed there. Asteroids are objects made principally of rock and metal that orbit the sun. They're smaller than a planet, and most are circling within the same region, the asteroid belt. There are some that, from time to time, pass close to Earth. Spaceships and satellites obtain energy in space from solar panels that produce electrical energy from the sun's rays. In space, it can be very cold and very hot. The sun's rays are very dangerous and there's no air to breathe. It is very dangerous. For this reason, astronauts must wear a special suit. The suit has many layers of clothing a helmet, cameras, microphones, a backpack with oxygen, lights. They even wear diapers for when they have to be away from the ship for many hours. The International Space Station is a laboratory in space that circles around the Earth. Astronauts from many different countries live in it and carry out many experiments and investigations while they are there. How do astronauts get to the space station? Well, with the Soyuz spaceship and rocket.
drag each constellation according to where you can see it from the Northern Hemisphere or the Southern Hemisphere.